The staffing shortage at the Doniana County Detention Center is at a critical level. That's how the director of the jail described the conditions two months ago. And ABC 7's Kate Beery asked the president of the officers union if anything has changed since then. She has this story you'll see only on ABC 7. Two months after our report highlighted critical staffing shortages at the Donia Anna County Detention Center, the president of the officers union says even more officers have left the jail. I've never seen this bad. I've been there 10 years, close to 10 years. Um, I've never seen it this bad. Sergeant Alex Segura says more officers are leaving the detention center. We've been short staffed before, but it's never been to the critical conditions that we have it right now. Members accuse the county of trying to bust their union by hiring more lieutenants. And I just feel like we're being slapped in the face, insulted at the same time. The county manager and jail director denied that, writing, quote, The lieutenant positions were not created to break up the union, but were done to increase the supervision of staff to avoid many of the issues we had in the past that were contributing to staff leaving. They say that has resulted in fewer employee complaints. Sergeant Segura said staffing levels of officers are at 45 percent. Very concerning, not just for our safety, but the safety of, the, of detainees as well. County management said that number is not accurate, writing, quote, The current shortage of detention center officers is related to the number of qualified applicants for the open positions. This is a situation being experienced nationally throughout the industry and not specific to Donia Anna County. How many more officers can you afford to lose? At this point, none. So what's next? What about the possibility of a strike? The president of the union could not comment on that. Reporting from Las Cruces with our New Mexico Mobile Newsroom, Kate Beery, ABC7. Antonio and County officials said they're they are short more than one in three officers. They have a vacancy rate of almost 38 percent.